Who? What is up, motherfuckers? Um, you, you guys, well, I actually already had something going, but, uh, I figure because this is such a touchy subject because it is breaking news. It's actually more news breaking than, than John Jones getting busted two days before his uh, showdown with Daniel Cormier at UFC 200, hence why I am not ordering that fucking pay-per-view. But, you know, that's neither here nor there. But, uh, space to his ass, so check it out. Um, well, first of all, I go 48-0, and this is Team Deathmatch. This ain't no motherfucking... St look at this. L look, uh, I, I start and I fucking finish. But I got 48 now and I'm gonna show you motherfucking how. Look at that precision! And I think it, I, th I think most of it had to do with the, the connection being on my side. But, um, going around right now, there's uh, a couple YouTubers who are acting like... Okay, so l let me just break it down before I get into it. Uh, the Syndicate Project, who I actually... And I, I know people go, what, what? I just, I don't really know the Syndicate Project. Oh, no, he is a fucking British accent. And I actually... Don't he, he, he has, you know, fucking, you know, three color hair stuff, but th that's not a reason I hate him, motherfucker. It's funny, but it's not a reason I hate him, but, but he and, um, the, the other cocksucker, I believe it's Ali A or T. Martin, one of them, either way, they're really two sides, two different sides of the same fucking coin. Um, they got, they got busted for, uh, from what I understand, an online gambling website here in the States, so they got felony possible charges thrown on them, and, uh, to me, that's, I don't give a fuck about that. Like, actually, I, I hang out with felons. That's all I really hang out with. People are like, oh my god, I can't believe it. What do you mean? They, they, they motherfucker. Okay, so, this is the point I'm trying to make. And, and I, like I said, I don't mind Syndicate, but Ali A and, and T. Martin could, you know, if, if they get arrested and, you know, some, some notorious shit happens then in prison, Guardian I'm not going to be completely mind. shocked. By the way, you're going to plant that. If you guys haven't caught on, you're going to plant that Guardian right there, and you're going to plant the center gun right in front of here. Hence, you'll see what I do like fucking five times because I get 48. No, so they don't kill me and I get all my score streaks. Anyway, Shot look at that sneak. So, people on YouTube, though, are, are making these videos being like, Oh my god, I can't believe And I don't know why I just like doing that fucking accent when they get in trouble. They're like, oh my god, they got caught doing fucking felonies. Yeah, no shit, fuckface. Every every one of us. I'm okay. I like I said, I don't think there's there's no river long enough that doesn't contain a bend. And the, everybody on YouTube, even me included, I'll throw myself under the same fucking bus. Uh we're all we are all susceptible and guilty of doing some illegal ass shit. So for people to, it's just because people didn't find out about the illegal shit that we do that people can sit on their fucking high horse and act like they, I can't believe they stole from kids and I can't believe they went on, you know, they had a gambling, motherfucker, they lucky that's all they did. You should hear about, I mean, I, nothing I do is like, like heinous. It doesn't like hurt people for the most part, but the, you should hear about the illegal shit that goes on in my life. And then you would probably not feel so fucking, but actually I think, I think that's why kind of people enjoy my stuff is because I kind of wear my heart on my sleeve, so to speak. And I would actually brag about, you know, the shit I got away with. Whereas these guys, I don't know, dude. Who the fuck knows? I think it's because they look so, oh, you know, so handsome and so fucking nice that they can't believe they did anything evil or, or malicious or fucking nefarious. Yeah, nefarious means bad for motherfuckers who don't know. By the way, the first time I ever heard nefarious was on World of Warcraft. Um, but yeah. Uh, the fucking, that little cocksucker white boy 7th street, or fucking we I'm, I'm sure the whole community is gonna be on these guys, and actually, I'm proud of these motherfuckers. I'm glad they did something, uh, you know, that's lucrative, that's illegal, possible felony charges, you know what, they're not so bad in my book. Um, and everybody's acting like they did these heinous ass things. Sure, but let, take a step back, motherfucker. All these people Remote talking all kinds out. of shit about them. It's like Rob Williams said, it's like a bunch of fucking lepers judging a beauty pageant. They have no room to speak. They have no room to talk. And uh, people are going to be like, well, for the first time, you're actually not being mean. It's because they're doing the fucking, they're not doing what's honest, but they're doing the real thing to them. You know, like they fucking, so what? They ran a gambling ring. Who gives a fuck? That's, that's street cred where I come from, motherfuckers. All right, so, so what, the next time you want to bash these motherfuckers, just be like, these are some real motherfuckers. Whereas, you got White Boy over there. The only reason White Boy didn't go to jail is because he Dangled snitched. Down. He had felony charges. Let's not forget about that shit. Um, and he snitched his way out of it. So, I mean, if, if Syndicate Project turns into the Snitch to Get Project, then I'll have a fucking problem. But until then, let the motherfucker slide. Uh, Ollie A, I'm, I'm sure he's gonna pull some kind of like lesbian, gay, bisexual movement thing, and he's gonna try to get them on his back and shit. I don't know, that's just my prediction. But it doesn't, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Anyway, 
let's just give these motherfuckers a break for being felons because like I said, all I hang out with some of the nicest people you ever meet on earth are probably felons. And just because they didn't get caught for a felony, they, they you still get in a felony. You don't, motherfucker, you don't pay the toll. If you fly through a toll and, uh, you know, on a highway, that's technically tax evasion if the government wants to get on you. So that's technically a felon. So, and I'm not, you know, I may or may not have done that, motherfucker, within the last week. You know, just, um, you can always take a, a license plate off with a quarter if it's not a Phillips head screwdriver. How weird is that? Anyway, um, so look, this is, look, I'm fucking smoking these noobs. Anyway, I am, uh, 23 and 0, fucking Michael Jordan. That's the perfect, I don't know why that number is so popular, but it is. So look, 23, 24, 25, I, I go up to 48 and I just slay these motherfuckers and it's continuous slaying of this shit. It's, I'm not gonna make some pussy reference because I know people will be like, oh dude, you slay the pussy like, that's too easy, motherfucker, but anyway. <clears throat> So, yeah, I, 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 I guarantee you all the, this will probably be the one video sticking up for these two fucking people. Ah, yeah, got his ass, beasted the fuck out of him. Anyway, like I said, this will probably be the only video sticking up for these two when it comes to the felony shit. And people go, oh, where am you? are a fucking criminal. Say whatever you want, bitch. These guys, you know what? I'm fucking, I'm envious. These guys probably made a fuck ton of money. The only thing that would suck is that. When they do do a felony thing like that, I just said doo doo. Uh, when they do a felony charge like that, uh, they freeze the assets. And I don't know if they'll freeze the, their YouTubes or, uh, you know, uh, obviously their PayPal bank again. BAM! He's firing fucking rockets. He's like, he's like Tito in fucking rush hour. And high powered 25. Oh, I got a brutal killer medal in this too. And it's a fucking, it's a hatchet. So you could call me Black Worm the fucking axe murderer, just like Vanderly Silva. But. Yeah, I, I I know they uh they freeze assets when they do shit like this. So, you know that would probably fucking suck. But, eh, you can't do the crime. Don't commit the crime is what they always say. I don't. I that doesn't apply to me. I I've done a lot of stupid fucking crimes. Ah, he's fucking sir. Why is he just fucking hanging out with? Him? Look at all these parts. This is like a tech guy's fucking wet dream. There are there are little computer parts. I don't know where all the fucking where'd the gun barrel go though. Um. Anyway, so. So, uh, yeah, don't listen to these cocksuckers, like, people just trying to cash in on their, uh, misfortune. Because anytime something bad happens like that, look, now he's throwing the fucking electromagnetic grenades. And it didn't take out my Guardian, because that shit, you know, I use fiber optics up in this bitch, all that YouTube money. You wonder where it goes. No going in the fucking cars. It goes into to my electronic weapons, son. But, yeah. So, um, the only ones who, uh... Who are keeping it real around these motherfuckers? Are probably me and those two motherfuckers. Well, I'm now at the same time. I wonder what kind of felonies the uh, the other YouTubers are committing, and I wonder who's next to fall under the fucking yes. Got him! There's another fucking century. Bam, motherfucker! See, and uh, okay, you gotta keep running around these parts too, okay? So don't let these miscreant homunculus little fucks sway your uh, your, your your train of thought or, or what you think. It's actually pretty cool that they. You know, did what they did. I'm not. I'm not endorsing what they did, but the fact that it, it just makes it look like they're not these wholesome, fucking pugilistic money. Money. Well, obviously they're they're money hungry, but don't fucking people are sitting on the other side of the internet being like, oh, money hungry. Everybody fucking can use some cash these days. Don't hate on the motherfuckers for it, all right? I can use some cash. You can use some cash. Then we're gonna go to Compton. Then we're gonna go to Yugoslav, and then we're gonna go to Washington. And yeah. And that, the whole point, every, even the presidential candidates, besides Trump, Trump has enough money. I don't know what the fuck, he's just, he's like that guy that just wants to burn! So, yeah, I don't know how that got, presidential candidates got brought into this whole, um, you know, YouTuber felony subject, but it did. So, it's getting near the end of the game. We're on the final minute countdown. Like I said, this shit, there's a lot of countdowns going on. The fucking countdown to whether these guys will be cuffed and stuffed up in the fucking... A lot of people call it Brown Town. I'm not going to tell you why, but a lot of people, you know, a lot of people call jail Brown Town. Uh, UFC 200 can- BAM! Look, the Brutal Killer! Got that shit! Brutal Killer! Shoulda- if I got three more, I know people would have been like, Oh, Worm, you got a nuclear! I didn't get three more with that, but look, 45 and 0. They don't even get me, I get three more kills in this motherfucker. Just savage as fuck. There's a lot of shit going on. I actually had a different upload of, uh, me coming out with a lot of phase cam, and I changed around the world. And a little bit. BAM! That motherfucker is savage with that fucking- Rocket launcher, though. He's. I'm not gonna say what uh, what what group he probably belongs to because there's a lot of PC motherfuckers on here. All right, I'll go. He's probably belongs to ISIS. All right. I don't know how the fuck they got fiber optic connection, but you know they they got oil wells and shit like that. But, but look, Centrica, 47, and within the last couple seconds, did I get the 40? I got the fucking last kill, but it was with my Centra gun. 
Anyway, this wasn't a live beat. I, I just had to go from theater. Anyway, motherfuckers, keep it greasy. It's